The TikTok platform is known for funny videos or people showing their talents, but also it gets a fair amount of puzzling mysterious content. And the one we're focusing on today in our video is time travel, or one alleged time traveler in particular, which is Unico Sobreviviente, which means the only survivor. He states, My name is Javier and I'm alone in the world, the only survivor. Today is February 13, 2027. I just woke up in the hospital and I'm alone in the Spanish city of Valencia. No one on the streets, no one in the malls, and no one on the beaches and no boats, and that he does not remember what happened to him or what he faced there, and that there is something strange about this hospital. It was without nurses, without patients, and without anyone at all. And when he came out of the hospital to see what's going on exactly, he did not find cars nor did he find anyone completely on the street, not even a bird in the air. And in order to prove his words, he shot this first video of these empty streets. The first video made quite a speculation at the time on social media. But people claimed that he photographed this clip during the ban period because of the pandemic. So his followers asked him to go back to the hospital where he woke up. And when he went, he photographed his trip. And as it appeared in the footage, the hospital was completely empty. There was no reception, no doctors, and no nurses, and no patients at all. And it is not possible for an entire hospital to go to this extent of work in order to deceive the public and make the TikToker famous. And the strange events continues when the audience noticed that all electronic devices were showing a date that was not in the year 2021. No, it is the year 2027 while paper documents was dated to the year 2021. The only survivor's followers doubt that he had certainly modified the date of the computer and left it in 2027 in order to deceive them with his story. But a follower wanted to challenge him by asking to ask the smart device Alexa for today's date. And the shocker was Alexa's answer. Okay, Google. Give you a chance for you. Domingo, 21 de marzo de 2027. That today's date is March 21st, 2027. The followers continue to challenge him to prove it's a lie, and that all of his videos are nothing but editing tricks and visual effects. The followers asked him to go to places known to be overcrowded, especially since this survivor lives in the Spanish city of Valencia, which has a population of 2.5 million people, and that it is quite impossible under normal circumstances to walk in the populated city without seeing anyone. And he accepted the challenge and of course he walked in the streets and took pictures and videos of it, also showing different empty shops. But his trips wasn't only to ordinary places. The survivor went to historical landmarks, such as the old churches in Spain and the places are completely empty. The only survivor continued to meet the requests of his followers, to some extent one of them asked for something more difficult, which is that he goes to the airport. The man didn't hesitate and went to the airport hall, which is supposed to be full of security guards and travelers, but it was empty. And it was even stranger that some flights were scheduled on the travel board. And in a new challenge, the followers asked him to go to the Spanish palace in Valencia and that he would be paid $500,000 if he fulfills the request. Though it is a bit puzzling how will he get the money if he's in the future. It is known that this particular area is highly guarded as the palace belongs to the Spanish kingdom and is of great importance. As usual, he entered the palace and visited the museum, which was without supervision and without anyone appearing to him. And quickly the TikTok community began to circulate the story of this person, and with it suspicion increased, and many people denied the survivor's words, and said that he was modifying the videos and some said that his videos were not real, 
but the survivor responded to them in his own way. He went to an area known for being overcrowded, and as usual it was empty, but surprisingly he directed the camera at the mirrors of a building that showed his reflection, thus proving that he is real and not just editing random videos. Other rumors came out saying that he was filming at dawn times when the city is usually empty, so the survivor proved the correctness of his videos by going to a public street, known for its consistent crowding, and showed his followers a street watch, and the time was 5.46 in the afternoon. And with another dangerous challenge of its kind, a follower asked him to go to the police station and enter its halls and offices, and the shocker that he actually did. And in another request, the followers challenged the survivor to go to the stadium of the Spanish club Valencia, who was able to enter comfortably and easily wander inside the players dressing rooms and then onto the pitch. In a new challenge, they asked him to go to the zoo, and the surprise was that the animals were also hidden from the zoo. After that, the survivor got bored and decided to challenge the followers himself. So he went and bought neck chains and medallions in certain areas and hiding them inside trees and other hidden places. Then he asked the followers to go around these places. And of course his followers went to these places and it were crowded with people. And they did find the same thing he left behind. But the real horror will begin immediately. All the strange things were mentioned are not as terrifying as the situation that is coming. This time, a television station decided to challenge the survivor by placing a book in a hidden corner of the studio in order for him to come and take it. El siguiente. Voy a colocar mi libro. Oh my god, que sale el miércoles 26 de mayo. Mira, voy a meter el libro aquí, lo escondo y tú vienes y lo coges, ¿vale? Aquí viene. Mira, ¿ves? Un Ahí está. A ver si eres tan listo, lo consigues encontrar aquí en el hormiguero y me lo enseñas. And unexpectedly, the survivor entered the studio which he portrayed as completely empty and took the hidden book. And when the TV station checked the recording of the surveillance cameras, they were surprised by a mysterious and transparent shadow that appeared in the CCTV footage. Obviously this story is very strange and contains a million theories, time travel, parallel universes or even ghosts, the last survivor on earth and the end of the world and the annihilation of mankind. You could believe his words or you could be skeptic and you want answers. You can see all of this just as an optical illusion or just professional level editing and that this man has come up with a new advanced illusion technique that he can do all of this with. But who is this person and what exactly does he want? No one knows yet. Is he just a seeker of fame? Or is he part of a new company doing an advanced advertisement for a new electronic software or product for example? Or is he someone that decided to take advantage of his abilities to play with humans and deceive them? Or is he really the only survivor in the year 2027? reaching out to us, giving us hints about our near future. And during the editing of this video, it was revealed that this content was made to advertise a new Spanish series called The Only Survivor. Thank you for watching the video. Please like and subscribe if you liked it, and if you didn't, tell me why in the comments, and tune in for more videos.